It's a summer detour that was supposed to be wrapped up before the first school bell rang, but that did not happen. Now back to school traffic is leading to long commutes for all. Orange cones have covered a busy stretch of Giles since spring. Good evening, I'm Jennifer Griswold. And I'm Craig DeGrelli. The project in Sarpy County has hit a few road bumps and is now behind schedule. The delays are taking a toll on families trying to get to school on time. Here's the stretch we're talking about, 144th to 156th on Giles. It's closed as construction workers add a lane. Now that closure is forcing traffic onto Chandler and Harrison, tying up traffic throughout the neighborhood. Reporter Joe Kadat is live on what drivers are saying tonight. Joe. Yeah, Craig, as you can see behind me, this construction project will likely not be complete by the end of this month. Now, it was originally slated when it opened back in April, the construction project to be done and finished with by July, but this has drivers very frustrated, as the county told me this morning, that this likely won't open as long as October. I'm just disappointed. I don't think I'm actually any more angrier than that. Um, it's just hard, like, getting make sure your kids get enough sleep, and then if you have to wake them up earlier, you know, it's harder to plan your day. So then trying to get them to go to bed earlier to make sure that, you know, they get enough sleep, it's just just a little frustrating. Amanda Talley already expects this side of town to have traffic issues. The mother of three says she has to get the family up another half hour earlier until Giles reopens. To get to school and daycare and, um, you just you know when the peak hours, so you just kind of try to avoid them. So you just you change your day for that. Parent Billy Valera shares Tally's disappointment. Uh, it is disappointing just because during pickup and taking the kids to school, it's it's hectic. Yeah. But other parents say it's expected and something they work around. I'm willing to live with the growing pains because we all knew it was coming. This is West Omaha. It just keeps growing and growing. So along with all the greatness you get out here comes the road construction. John Winkler is the manager of the Chelco Hills Recreation Area right in the middle of the construction. He says his employees were briefed by Sarpy County Public Works to make sure their millions of annual visitors know how to get in and out of the park while construction continues. They might have to get up a little early to get to work on time, but uh, it really hasn't been that big of an inconvenience uh, through the entire construction. And uh, the county's been very good about informing us of the construction timeline and when routes would be closed and alternate routes that we would need to take. And, Sar and Sarpy County Public Works tells me that Harrison, that project, won't begin to start widening that road until at least a year from now. And that's partially because they want Giles to be completely finished and completed in other construction projects they have in mind, possibly completed as well before they start work on Harrison. Reporting live at 151st and Giles, Joe Kadat, KMTV Action 3 News. And drivers and